By the way, this is the first time I've worn this hat out in public since you know what. I was worried I might get a boo. You might still get a boo at this point. You know what I'm thinking? <laughs> no, like, don't say I mean, that. from the right person, who knows? <laughs> the biggest fight I've ever been in in my life with Tom Sandoval was the name of the bar, Schwartz and Tanks. He campaigned so hard. Mr. Marketing Genius put that name on the side of the building. And when you do that, you have to hold yourself to a higher standard. Anyway, I'm rambling. Do we just call it Schwartz and Jamesies? <laughs> After Tom's affair became public, our beautiful bar, Schwartz and Sandy's, became like the scene of the crime. Reservations are down, a bunch of the staff has quit. We felt like zoo animals in there, you know? People were harassing servers, coming in there with a vengeance. It was toxic. Right now, I do have a lot of resentment for Tom Sandoval. He said, I'm sorry that I put you in a f***ed up position and that I essentially used you as a shield for my affair. I'm Damn. I mean, one of the last things I said to Tom, I was like, after the f***ing hell you put me through, after what you did to your friends, what you did to Ariana, I was like, you better f***ing spend the rest of your life with Raquel. I got enough problems in my life. It's just like, I did not need this. My God, man. Permission to bitch a little? Last year almost just broke me. I got divorced. My brother Bird has been having some serious health issues. Like, we had so many bar woes. You could almost say that Scandival was kind of like a radioactive cherry on top of my Sunday of a year. Hi. Hello. What are you doing? I'm just relaxing before I go work out. Oh, okay. I'm nervous. What are you nervous about? I'm going to TomTom Tom tonight. I haven't been there since, like, that night that all of that transpired. <laughs> Part of me was like, should I just not go? And then I was like, no, if I don't go, then it's like, that wins. I shouldn't have to make my life smaller because Tom messed everything up. And if I can go there and make new memories, maybe it won't have power over me anymore and I'll be able to just look at it as some bar. You always got me. Mm-hmm. I'm sure you from New York. <laughs> from New York. <laughs> yeah. 2,427 to be exact, I think. I looked yeah. once. <laughs>